In this video, we'll be finding the LU decomposition of a non-square matrix. So we're given a 3 by 2 matrix, and we want to find L and U such that L times U is A, and A is the original matrix here. So this means that L is a 3 by 3 matrix, and U is a 3 by 2 matrix. So this is how I know that. So let's say the dimensions of L are M by N. We know u has to be n by, let's say, p. And this is equal to a, which is a 3 by 2 matrix. Whenever you're multiplying matrices, these two numbers have to be the same. Okay. And the outer numbers are what go over here. So m has to be 3, and p has to be 2. l is going to be a square matrix. So because M is 3, N also has to be 3. And so now we figured out the dimensions. L is 3 by 3. P is 3 by 2. Okay. So we're going to start off with L being the identity matrix and U being the original matrix. Okay. So this is what we're working with. Now what I want to do is get u to be upper triangular. Basically, these three numbers here are going to be zeros. Okay. So how do we do that? Well, we're going to work with the first row. So the goal is to get these two numbers first. Okay. And then finally, we'll get this third number. So in order to get these first two numbers, you have to work with this number here. In other words, this row. Because this uh, column has a one, you wanna work with the first row. So what we do is take 5 thirds, row one, add it to row two. That's gonna be my new row two. Okay, so u becomes three, four, and then zero, 29 thirds, five, four. So the only thing we did was we, was we changed the second row. Now, what did we do? We multiplied by 5 thirds. So take opposite of what you multiplied row 1 and put it in this uh, entry right here. Okay. Now, we want to cancel out the 5 here because I want this to be 0. So what we do is take negative 5 thirds row 1, add it to row 3. So what do we do? we multiply by negative 5 thirds. So you take the opposite of negative 5 thirds, which is positive 5 thirds. And because we're working on row three, we're gonna go over here and pl plug in 5 thirds. Now u is looking like this. So we're almost done. We need to make this zero. Okay, well, how do we do that? Well, we know that's gonna be the second column so which second column has a 1? Well, it's a second row. The second row has a 1. So that means you're going to use row 2 to cancel out row 3. So what do we do? We multiply row 2 by negative 8 over 29 and then add it to row 3. That's going to be my new row 3. So now in our identity or in our matrix L, this number is just going to be the opposite sign of 8 over 29. So it's going to be positive 8 over 29. And so this is going to be my LU decomposition for this matrix.